What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Thanks for hanging out with me again. Uh, we're going to break down Blind Melon Change. It's the same three easy chords and a personal favorite song of mine. So I think uh, there's a lot of fun to be had. So let's zoom in and break it down. Also, real quick, thank you for uh, supporting me by supporting Marty Music. Appreciate it. All right, let's start with the chords. We're going to start with an A major chord. And this whole song is three chords. So A major, then we're going to go to G, so three, two, three, three, and then D, and use that ring finger to pivot, D, back to G real quick, then back to A, starts over on A. Give you a rhythm in a second. One more time. A to G D G A. The other section D G to A. Dun, 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 dun. D G A. One little turn around, G, back to the first part. So that's the whole song. That's the whole song. So let's get a rhythm going. This can be varied a bit, but this is a good starting rhythm. Down, 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 up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up. other part. D, G, A. There's embellishments I'm going to show you in a sec. D, G, A. D, G, A. Then the G, D. And so arrangement wise, the first time it ever gets to that part, rocks out. When it goes through it again, uh, G, you know, it's got to go to a guitar solo, which is over the main part, right? And then finally, at the end of the song, it breaks it back down. Instead of a break, it's... You know, just drums it out. All right, now let me show you the cool embellishments. Now these embellishments will, will always work on these chords. You can try them out and change them up and use them in your own little arsenal of creativity. So with the A major chord, you can add your pinky to the, th to the uh, third fret of the B string, take it off, and then lift your ring finger, and then back on. Very standard, classic, acoustic rock and roll stuff, right? When we get to this G, it's kind of tricky, but you can reach your pinky up to the fifth fret, the high E there. So you can go. So you can pull it off and put it back on. And then D, G, 
which I'm hearing him add that sometimes, right? And then this again starts over. Thanks again, you guys. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, hope to see you again in another lesson real soon. Feel free to leave your requests in the comments below. Thanks again. We'll see you later. Uh. Cost close to nothing.